Hey everybody, it's Cindy, Palm Springs Cindy. I wanted to just video and say hello because I recently had an accident and I was walking uh, middle of the afternoon, I was walking to play bridge and I was carrying kind of a large shoulder bag and in my shoulder bag I had a jacket and a visor and some papers and stuff. Well, anyway, as I was walking, my sandal just caught the pavement in a certain way, and I tripped, and I lost my balance, and I fell. And as I fell, I tried to block my fall with my arm and my hand, and as I did so, I broke my wrist. So I have sort of been a little bit out of commission when it comes to YouTube, and I have not been able to... Um, <laughs> really use my arm and uh, hand the way I need to. But at any rate, I am videotaping now just to be able to tell you that story as well as a few other things. Okay, a couple things I wanted to share and talk about. Number one, getting back to my fall and my accident, I a part of my getting older is that I do not want to wear orthopedic type shoes and um, I always have liked wearing some type of a little heel and in fact I've even done a video on some of the little heels that I've bought but since my fall and since um, I am I'm just afraid of falling again I have decided that I I've been looking into cute shoes that are more um, safe. And a couple brands that I've been looking at, one brand that I learned from a friend of mine is Taryn Rose, although they're very expensive and, um, you know, I'm not so sure how cute they are, but um, I'm convincing myself that they are cute. And then I have, um, well, actually, I'm going to take this pair of shoes off that I just bought it's going to be hard for me because my wrist is broken, but hold on. So look at these. I bought these little gladiator shoes and see it does have somewhat of a um of a of a little heel here. I forget what that's called, but it's a you know, look how you can see I've been wearing these, but they are because of all the straps, they're they I feel like they're really on my feet. And so I bought a pair of these in this tan color, and I bought a pair similar, but not exact, in black. And I've really been wearing them, and I've been enjoying them. But, um, so if any of you have any cute brands, I've looked at some naturalizers. I used to wear those when I went to work, when I was teaching and doing a lot of walking. But I, um, you know, I just... I just love shoes and I love cute sandals. So I, I really want to continue wearing cute shoes even though I'm getting older. So if anybody has some good brands, uh, take a picture or comment so that I can look into those. Okay, another thing that I'm going to be doing, um, I have had a summer of fantastic garage sailing. And uh, I, I'm really getting into the idea of recycling and upcycling and reusing. And up here in Sun Valley, they have some really great um, garage sales. In fact, a lot of the people here that snow ski or whatever, then they leave or their kids outgrow their ski equipment and their jackets and all that. So um, I have bought some great things from garage sales for pennies on the dollar and I'm going to be showing you pictures and the prices of some of the great things that I've purchased this summer and um, with that just encouraging everyone else out there to check your local paper and find out and go see some of the finds and merchandise that you can pick out from your local garage sales and in addition to that um, I also have a video ready, well, almost ready, on consignment shopping. Um, that's another way to buy some great things that have been used, gently used, and yet are um, not quite so pricey and still cute. In fact, I just went to a consignment store the other day because it's starting to get cold here, 
and I bought two beautiful cashmere sweaters. They were like $45 each. And I bought a gorgeous black leather jacket that was like new and it's buttery and beautiful, soft. And it was, I think, $50. So um, don't forget your consignment stores for women's clothing. Some of them are a little more luxurious uh, consignment stores than others, but uh, you know, whatever works for you and whatever you're looking for. So at any rate, I'm off today to go find some more shoes and I need some makeup. So I'm gonna be driving into Twin Falls this afternoon, but I did want to at least do an introduction to let you know that I have been off schedule due to my accident. And so for everybody out there watching, be careful. All right, signing off until our next conversation. Palm Springs, Cindy.